So this is for my week seven research babble, and um, I already started on week eight, and I only have one thing next week, so I'm really excited about that. It's a poem, and I got a head jump on that, and I'm working on looking at how the poem, it talks about money and the importance of money in the capitalistic society and how we're willing to give up our friends. Now, it was written in the 1600s, so I was really excited to see like the different viewpoints that was there and like the talking about, instead of like cash money, like actually like currency and like the coins and having gold and myrrh, and it was just a really interesting viewpoint there. So I started working on that, I'm not quite done, and it's a reflection on like how it relates to everything else. Because whenever we talked about oh, oh, capitalism within like Marxism, we saw that there must be a currency. And I think the one thing that I had a hole in my argument was you know the missing um, element, that element of money or wealth. But let's look, focusing on my week seven, um, it was really good also. I only had three sources, so I kind of felt relieved as I was trying to put together my research paper. Um, I read two articles, one of them kind of morphed into an essay more, and then one short story. Now the short story was called The Seed, and this was like a really good, like inspirational story. I found it on Inspire 21, which is one of my favorite sites. And it just talks about how like a businessman gave uh, all of his executives a seed and told them to grow something and they would be hired based on that. And everyone grew something huge and this one man didn't grow anything. And he went into the meeting and he was like, I have nothing, my pot's empty. And the executive was like, you know, the seed was boiled. So all these other people gave into deceit because they wanted that capitalistic advancement of themselves. And this really showed me like, this is what capitalism causes people to do. This is an effect of capitalism and literature. And it was just like really good and I really was able to make that um, association. Now, what I kind of talk, wanted to talk about was with the essays and the articles was the way I analyzed them this week. Um, this week I decided to do one, an essay plan, two, a CD, CDW, and then the other one I did a classic model. Now, all three of these are like essay sort of types. They're more like formal writings. And it was a bit odd and definitely a little bit more overwhelming, but it was able to help me like to start put my th putting my thoughts into a more formal manner, and it helped me you know start preparing for that research paper. I did make like a graphic organizer for all my sources, and I think my paper is going to come together pretty nicely, and I'm looking forward to it. That's all.